Hello everyone. Welcome back to Steel Forest Welding and Forge. I've got a quick video for you folks today. I get a lot of common questions about my rocket stove, so I thought I would take a moment to make a video to address most of those questions and also to display my new model rocket stove. So first question, do I sell them? Yes, I do. The best way to contact me is through either Facebook Messenger or through Instagram Messenger. Links to both of those profiles is down below in the description. So just shoot me a message. I will send you the cost. I'll send you how much the shipping should cost and a total, and we can go from there. Do I ship the stoves? Yes, I do. I have shipped these all the way from the western U.S. all the way to the eastern coast of the U.S. These go everywhere across our great nation of ours. I have two models available, the deluxe model and the compact model. Now, the deluxe model is a slightly more powerful stove. These stoves top out anywhere from about 460 to 470 degrees Fahrenheit on the surface of the cast iron skillets. The compact model on the surface of the cast iron skillets tops out around 420 degrees Fahrenheit. The difference in power is due to the difference in the size of the chimney. More chimney, more draw, more power. Your typical runtime for a hopper full of sticks is about 20 minutes. I have run these stoves for about an hour straight. I just keep feeding it more and more and more fuel. A good rocket stove will burn and create almost no smoke and almost no sparks. The ash burns down to such a fine powder that most of it blows away, which is why these don't have ash dumps. That's another common question that I get. Now, as far as the um, choices between these two, why you should go with one model or the other. Compact model. Now, granted, this is an older model. You can see from the type of standoffs that I have here, that's how I used to build them. Now, I build them with this removable grating up here on top. A lot of the feedback that I got, people asked for a wider cooking area, so that's why now I sell it with this option. Now, the compact model, as I said before, doesn't burn quite as hot, but it is quite smaller, quite lighter. I build these out of 14 gauge material, so this thing fits in the back of your car, no problem, or even in a uh, large backpack. This is my deluxe model, so your main advantage with this model is again more power, but you also have a cover for your hopper. So you can put your sticks in here and just keep this open and run it at full blast. And that's how you get that 460 to 470 degrees Fahrenheit temperature, or you can close the hopper and it'll actually cool your flame down a little bit. Uh, not a significant amount. It cools it down probably to around 430 degrees. So these do have wooden handles. These are solid welded all the way around. Um, I've made probably close to almost 100 of these stoves now. I have rarely get any uh, negative feedback, it's all, almost always positive, and the negative feedback I did get was, again, for the standoff. So, that's why I offer a larger standoff now. These are painted in a high-temperature high primer and high-temperature ceramic paint. This paint goes up to 2,000 degrees, which is more than enough for what these stoves do. So, folks, if you're interested in purchasing one of these stoves, please check the descriptions down below. Feel free to send me a message. I can shoot you a price, shipping estimate, and we can go from there. Thanks for watching, everyone. Work hard. Stay humble.